I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about differentiation with natural logs and exponentials. And we're going to differentiate each function with respect to x. So, if I was given this function, y equals the natural log of the natural log of 3x to the third power. Now, you might see it like this, but what we really are doing is the natural log of 3x to the third power and the natural log of the natural log of 3x to the third power. If you want to put parentheses these in, it really helps see what's going on. So we're applying the chain rule twice with some natural log rules as well. We have dy dx right here it is equal to, well, the derivative of the natural log right, of whatever the inside is 1 over the inside. So the inside here is just this natural log of 3x to the third power, natural log of 3x to the third power, times the derivative of the inside. Well, the derivative of the inside involves another set of a chain rule. Okay? natural log of that inside, we have well, 1 over the inside. So 1 over, this could be 1, but a straight line now, 1 over 3x to the third, times the derivative of the inside, derivative of 3x to the third, um, 3 comes down, 3 times 3 is the 9, and we have x, uh, let's try to subtract the exponent by 1, which gives us x squared. We can put it over 1 to help maybe see it a little nicer, but there we have it. We've taken the derivative. Now, at this point, it's just algebra, and we are simplifying. So, we have equal to, well, 9 and 3. 3 goes into 9 three times, right? So, we cancel that out. We're up to the 3 right there. And the x squared cancels out here with x to the third. We get rid of the third exponent. So, now we just have 3 over x there. So, our numerator is only a 3. Let's put the x out front, x times, and what's left over here. Natural log of, oops, almost forgot the 3 there. Funky, but of 3x to the third power. And there we have it, our final answer. So let's recap. We're going to, oops, y equals the natural log of the natural log of 3x to the third power. Well, when we take the derivative, we're going to chain rule, so uh, and the natural log rule, 1 over the inside, which is just natural log of 3x to the third, times 1 over the inside of that, we're doing the chain rule, derivative of the inside, which involves the natural log rule again. 1 over 3x to the third times the derivative of 3x to the third, which is 9x squared. At that point, we've taken the derivative and we need to simplify. 9 and 3 simplify to so have 3 in the numerator. x to the squared, or x squared over x to the third, simplifies to have x in just the denominator. 1x in the denominator. So it goes right? Well, we rearrange that x to come up front. 3 is the numerator. So again, final answer here is 3 over x times the natural log of 3x to the third. 